Hey everyone, what's up? It's Zach here, another YouTube video today. Um, today I want to talk about race because racism is at its all time high, okay? People are being racist for no reason, just to be racist, and that's uh, part of a lot of our problems is racism. Now, if you think about it, when there's a shooting, the media looks for race. Oh, was it a white person or a black person? Was it a cop and a white person? Or, you know, they don't even care if it's a uh, black on black crime or white on white crime. Is it black on black or white on white crime? They'll be like, two seconds, okay, there was a shooting, this happened, this person on the loose got arrested. It's done. Never hear about it again. If it's a white person and a black person, like, this person was murdered viciously by this person, this person is still on the loose, we need to capture this person, this person was murdered viciously, and yeah, all these people were recording it and helping them, and da, 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 okay. Well, that's one reason racism is all the time high. Another reason is, you know, way the people were brought up, and okay. I understand being brought up a certain way and believing what you believe in after being brought up that way, but being racist is not going to get you nowhere at all. It's really not going to get you anywhere. I mean, in your life, it's not going to get you anywhere. And I'm going to bring an example into this, okay? I watched a video on YouTube today. It was about this person, a couple, they had a son, and they had, and the dog was attacking them, okay? Now, all these people were saying, sounds about white, white, W-H-I-T-E, white, or, you know, crazy crackers out again. Okay, first off, every race has their issues, whether you're Mexican, Japanese, white, Hispanic, Mexican, black, whatever your case is, every race has their issues with, whether it be gangs, drugs, guns, uh, sexual predators, rapists, assaults, you know. Okay, every race is going to have people that do that. And also at the same time, every race is going to have people that just want to live their life and do what's right. And every race is going to have people like me who just want race to stop. You know, I mean, I don't care if you are black, Mexican, Chinese, Japanese, whatever your case may be. I don't care what skin color you are. I mean, race has nothing to do with it for me. As long as you treat me with respect, I'll treat you with respect. You know, and people don't seem to understand that, you know. Why can't we just judge people off by respect? And as long as you treat me with respect, I'll treat you with respect. And, you know, now people are just being racist is to be racist. And, you know, it's not everybody. It's just certain people, and them certain people ruin it for everybody else. And, you know, the white people being racist ruin it for the black people that don't want to be racist, and the black people being racist ruin it for the white people who don't want to be racist. It just creates this big divide, and nobody wants to work together. And, you know, people aren't going to want to work together because the media is always going to be showing this, showing that, and... You know, some people, you know, like pretty much advertise racism, but oh, this happened today, this happened today, and then you got all these comments, oh, sounds white, you know, this white person did this, or a black person did this, or whatever. And, you know, it seems like people don't care, which it does seem that way, but, you know, a lot of people want racism to end. And me doing my job dealing with people every day, I come across both kinds every day. Every single day I work, I come across racist people and non-racist people every single day. Every day I work. It has not been a day that I have not come across both kinds. And it's sad that we have even, I mean, even one person that's racist, okay? Even if someone had a bad encounter with someone, you know, okay, I mean... That's one person, you know, and the same thing goes with cops, you know, and this makes no sense to me whatsoever. People say cops are the KKK or cops are white supremacists or 
cops, all cops are racist. Well, if that's the case, how do you explain all the black cops, all the Chinese cops, all the Mexican cops? Because, I mean, I'm just wondering. I mean, y'all said all cops are KKKs and white supremacists. So, I mean, I mean, you got black cops, Chinese cops, Mexican cops as well. So, I mean, I'm just wondering. I mean, that makes no sense whatsoever to your, for the people saying that. That just makes y'all self look dumb and stupid, but whatever y'all feel like saying to uh, keep the racial divide going, good for you, I guess, if that's what you want. And, you know, I've seen comments lately, you know, I've had white people tell me that white people can't be racist, and I've had black people tell me that black people can't be racist. And for the people saying that, y'all are stupid, honestly. I'm gonna come out and be blunt, y'all are stupid. Because you, you don't speak for everybody in your race, okay? And don't, these people saying this were posting racist comments. So for y'all to say black people can't be racist, white people can't be racist, no, just shut up. Just just stop. I mean, everybody, you don't speak for every single black person or you don't speak for every single white person in your race. And even if they weren't racist, that comment's still invalid because you don't speak for everybody in your race. But then they post racist comments on uh, top of that and below that. So, I mean, their comments invalid either way. I mean, it makes no sense to me. What I mean, I really don't get it. And, you know, we got people over there in the wars getting blown up, losing limbs, getting shot, you know, having PTSD, getting traumatized, paralyzed, uh, losing family members, losing husbands, wives, Friends, fathers, daughters, sons, grandparents, aunts, uncles, you know, and we're over here arguing because one person's white, one person's black. I mean, I mean, what is this? I mean, why why we even have time to argue? We shouldn't have time to argue about it. We should be busy stopping the crime and working together. But instead, we want to be out here, you know, talking about, well, Trump did this today. Obama did this better than Trump, Trump did this better than Obama, or white people are better than black people, black people are better than white people, blacks did this today, or white person did this today, or uh, a black person did this to a cop, a white person did this to a cop, a cop did this, you know, okay. If somebody did something wrong, yes, call them out, that's fine, take them to jail, do what you need to do, but don't sit here and be racist every day, I mean, it's racing your time, one, is wasting your life. It's wasting other people's lives trying to get on with their life and enjoy their life for them having to see it. It's really a waste of everybody's time and it's pointless because it's not going to get you anywhere. But give you enemies in the long run, are these people agreeing with you? If there's a race war, are they going to sit here and agree with you and back you up? Probably not. They're probably going to go get whatever they need to do. Um, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you guys think.